We covered a lot of introductory material in this module. We learned that this course covers the digital forensics imaging and hashing tools found in Kali GNU Linux, and that additional Kali forensics tools will be covered by other Pluralsight courses. This course should be of interest to people who work as digital forensic examiners, IT professionals who use forensic tools, and to people interested in certifications and a career in digital forensic work. We also learned that this is not intended to be a comprehensive course in Linux, Kali Linux, or digital forensics. We learned that Kali Linux is a very popular distribution of Linux, based on Debian GNU Linux, and was formerly named Backtrack. Kali is specialized for use in information security, especially penetration testing, vulnerability analysis, reverse engineering, and digital forensics. Kali is actively maintained by offensive security and has strong support from an active user community. Kali is open source and is always free to obtain and use. We learn that forensics is fundamentally the presentation of evidence in a court of law. Digital forensics is the more modern term for computer forensics and implies that digital information does not necessarily come from computers. Forensic examinations are performed with standard procedures and with methodical rigor using testable and verifiable tools that are known and accepted by the digital forensics community. There are six stages that all forensic examinations use, known as collecting, preserving, verifying, identifying, analyzing, and presenting. These stages are used to prepare evidence for both legal and empirical evaluation. In closing this module, let me leave you with some words of wisdom from one of my most well-respected digital forensic instructors. Forensics is about documentation. If you are not documenting, then you aren't doing forensics. In the next module, we will take a deeper dive into Kali by looking at an overview of all the forensics tool categories available in Kali and showing you a few demos of how you can get your own Kali Linux forensic workstation up and running.